Hi, welcome back. So now what we're going to do is run through the different tapping points. Now you may already have been using EFT, but what I'd like you to do is follow along with these points specifically, as they may be different to anything that you have learned before with EFT. This is called the Heart and Soul Protocol. So we're going to place our hands just here. And this is where we say the setup phrase. But for now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get you to follow me with the different points. And we're just going to get familiar with all the different points. So while we've got our hands just here, I want you to take in a nice deep breath. And another one. And one more. That's great. Okay, now we're going to move to the tapping points, okay? So I just want you to just very, very gently tap on each point. So we've got the top of the head, the third eye, this is just in the centre of your forehead, so just tap gently there, just notice any sensations that come up for you as you tap around the different points. Then this is the, um, and it doesn't matter which which side of the face that you go, it, you can you can tap here one round, you can tap this side another round, it doesn't matter. So you're going to tap at the start of the eyebrow and then you're going to go to the outside of the eyebrow and then underneath the eye, underneath the nose. and the chin area. I often get sort of like a tingly sensation, so sort of like, you know, spreading it across my face, but you know, wherever I'm, I'm tapping. And that, that's perfectly normal if you get that sort of thing. So the collarbone. So if you find your, your collarbone and then there is a dip just here. So you want to be just underneath the collarbone. So if you can imagine where if you had a tie on and the tie would sort of sit here, the, the knot of the tie would sit here. So you want to be aiming, so if you want to, you can place the flat bit of your hand, the, the base of your hand just there, actually on the middle bit uh, where the tie would hang and you can just tap like that. I tend to just use like all of my fingers and just tap in that area. It, you want to be tapping in the soft area there. Okay. Some people will use the Tarzan tap, as I call it, and just tap on on the area there. Okay. Don't get too stressed out about whether you're tapping in the right place or not. It, it, the chances are you are in the right place, so don't don't worry about exactly where you're tapping. Just tap in that general area there. Okay, then we move on to the um, the hand. So we're going to tap the outside of the thumb and then move on to the finger. So I tend to use three fingers here just to cover the whole area. The thumb, then you move on to your fingers. One, two, three, finish with your baby finger, four. And then we move to what we call the karate chop. So this point along here. So just, I use, usually use all of my fingers here and just tap in this area. So that's where we finish the tapping points. And then we come back to the heart healing position or we continue for another round. 
so we will finish there for for this um, for this video I want you to get really really familiar with the tapping points and if you find that tapping for any reason um, maybe if you have a headache or something like that maybe if if the tapping is causing you know any pain or any discomfort for any reason you can just t you can actually just touch the points okay just touch and hold touch and hold touch and hold this is a very gentle treatment touch and hold or you can gently massage the points okay some people some people prefer the touch and, and tap or the massage um, the, uh, the touch and hold or the massage to the actual tap in so it's it's personal preference and whatever feels the most effective and most natural for you okay so I'd encourage you to experiment with the different methods um, but for now just just get really used to the different points and just focus on the points um, and where, where they are and without actually um, without actually focusing on a problem at this stage so once you feel comfortable with the tapping points and you've tried out the different uh, methods of either tapping, touching or massaging, then move on to the next video. So I will see you there. Bye.